Hello and welcome back to my channel. Today I have another Dollar Tree haul for you guys. Um, I went the other day to pick up a few things and I got in there and I fell in love with some things. But we're going to get ready to jump into it. I figured I'd make this video today because it has been one of the most awful days for me. Um, uh, two nights ago... And I had heard some dogs fighting, and I have an eight-year-old uh, black lab, and I have a, another dog that's uh, barely like a year old that is, uh, well, he's like mixed with uh, Great Pyrenees and uh, something else. But I hear dogs fighting, which I don't know like who uh, wasn't uh, fighting because my youngest one, he don't fight nothing. And uh, but I went out, and uh, something had got, uh, we got out there, and uh, it was like in the middle of the night, but my dog got tore up pretty bad. I thought he was losing his vision, and uh, so I kept him put up for a couple days, but somehow last night, he escaped, and I, I got woke up again, and in the middle of the night, and I heard dogs just like, whoop, going at it. It was like the most horrible thing I ever heard. And, uh, so we get up, we go out, and, cause we hear it right in the driveway, and I live, like, on a, like, out in the middle of really nowhere, and, um, I only have a few neighbors, but, and really there ain't, like, no close houses to me, uh, well, not really close, close, but I, like, have two neighbors, uh, that are close, and, uh, but, so I go out, and, um, uh, I look around back and um, I can see from the back porch that um, the dog lot is shut. So I said, well, he's up, thank God. And um, I knew the other one was tied up, so I knew he was all right because I could see him out my bedroom window when I got up. And then it wasn't, um, my husband ran the dogs off and it's probably about 30 minutes later. I just went back to sleep and my dog starts barking again. It's my young dog. He was barking his head off, and I was like, Phew. so he wouldn't quit, and I was like, we got up, and we looked, and my husband kept seeing something moving behind the truck, and he walks down there, and it was my poor uh, Droopy. That's what my eight-year-old's name was. His name was Droopy, he was, and it was just horrible. Some dogs had torn him to pieces, and so we end up losing him, and he is like the most horrible thing I've think I've been through in a long, long time. So I'm like doing anything today, I like to keep my mind occupied off him. So I figured I'd do this video and um, try to keep my mind off him. But I'm gonna show you some things I did get. I ended up finding these sequin pillows. They're not really that big, but they are really cute, and they, you know. Maybe like for a little girl's room or even in like some living rooms. These would look so pretty. They had multi colors. Uh, they had all, uh, probably like 10 different colors. And what I liked about it, some of them was like uh, pretty much, you know, same like fabric on the back and kind of like look like they's going to be the same until you moved it around and it ended up being different colors. So I ended up getting the white and the gold. And I got a like peak. It's kind of like in the camera, it kind of looks pink, but it, in person, it kind of looks more like a peach color. And it's like pink and gold around the front. And I got a blue, and then it is blue and purple. I love playing with these. I also got another blue one. As you can see, they're like pretty much the same color. But it is like a blue and silver. And the last one I got was a black one. I actually found, when I was looking through them, I didn't find this one. Um, when I was going through the aisles, uh, someone had laid this down in like the food section. So it was like kind of a weird spot. But it is like multicolored. Uh, this is probably my favorite one. But I got five of them and I really do like them. I just don't know what I'm going to do with them. Because I don't have no little girls. 
my living room's done in primitive stuff, so the pillows I have in here, this really just ain't gonna match. But I'll probably just throw them in my bedroom, on my bed, or on my little bench in there or something. <coughs> okay. So the next thing I got was they had some, like, new kitchen stuff in, and they was, like, having, like, two different color scheme going on. And I kind of like both colors, um, which we'll talk about that in a minute. But the two colors, like, and I got this towel, and it's just a regular uh, microfiber towel for your kitchen. And I like that they had all the sets. That's what blew me away. So it's just like a regular size. And then I got the two pot holders in the same design. And I also ended up getting the oven mitt in this design. I liked how it was all together. And normally, like, even a dollar store, Walmart, you're not going to, like, to buy the whole set. I want you don't get two pot holders. You get, like, this and probably one of these and one of these for probably five to, what, seven, eight dollars. So, I really thought for, like, three dollars, this was a really good deal. And especially since it's, like, a you know, spruce your kitchen up a little bit. Now, they had these in different colors, too. But, they, um, they was, like, running out. They had, like, I think three different colors. They had, like, pink and purple and, like, a bluish green color. But I ended up, since I have so many, I've been buying so many of these lately, I ended up just getting this one. I wish I had got the bluish green color, but I didn't. So, I got it. I haven't decided what to do with it yet. I'm thinking maybe like tea lights or something like that. I'm not really for sure. And I had waited and waited for my Dollar Tree to bring, um, like, I think it was like mermaid uh, clip uh, nail clippers in. And I waited and I waited, but it never happened. And it probably ain't going to happen. But I found these. Um, so every time I go, I always look uh, to see what they got. And I found these. They're just like little um, feet in a pink color. I thought they was just so cute. And I actually, I have already opened them. And I used the toenail clippers and they worked wonderfully. And I ain't even gonna lie, um, where I keep nail polish on my toenails all the time, when I go cut my toenails, they should be softening. Uh, it should be like after I take a bath or something, but I always wait, I don't know. Don't know why my husband says I don't know why you don't wait till you take a bath and then cut your toenails, but I don't. And they're harder than a rock uh, because of the nail polish makes them harder. But they done such a good job, and they're just like little regular nail clippers. And I guess, and like what I like about them is like where they got the holes, you can put them on a keychain, throw them in your purse if you, you want to. Because I do like always keeping uh, something like this in my purse. You never know when you're out and about and the kids will break a nail. Or like I did, break broke my nail the other day. And it was got so long. I wanted to cry, but I didn't. And, um, but I really did like them. Okay, and the last thing is, I debated on getting this. But I've been wanting a new set for a while. And when I seen them, I was like, they had two colors. They had uh, the color I got in a lighter color in like pretty much the same thing, but just like a couple shades lighter. Okay, so I got disconnected there, but what I was saying is I've been wanting these for a long time and I would finally decided, uh, I debated on them while I was down there and they did have like two colors like I was saying. I don't know if they caught that or not, but and they had the, uh, the color I got in a like few colors, like maybe like a seafoam green or something. But they did have some new dishes in, and I really just like them. I like the color. I think they're simple, but they they really look good. I ended up all together. I ain't even unwrapped them yet. I got four plates. They're all still like wrapped up. I ended up getting four of these. And 
And then I ended up getting four of these. Uh, my family consists just of four people, and so I ended up getting four, 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 but only four, two of us drinks coffee, but they do like hot chocolate and stuff, so I ended up getting four of the coffee cups. I mean, they're so nice. And actually, um, after I got these, even though I've watched all of Desperate Housewives, I don't know, I was re-watching it, and they uh, exactly have these dishes on Desperate Housewives. Uh, like, uh, which one was it? I already forgot her name. The, the blonde. She had these dishes in her house. She was uh, always drinking coffee out of one just like this. I thought that was kind of cool. I about forgot about it. Okay. And the last thing I got was... Ended up... Let me see. I haven't unwrapped anything yet. Ended up getting four of the matching bows. And look how deep these are. These are like uh, so deep. And I don't know, ever since my kids have been little, I've not bought glass bows. And now they're like, um, maybe I'll be 11 next month. And my oldest one is uh, 12 and a half. And, said, and I'm like, yeah, you know what? I can have glass bows now. Because they are finally big enough that I can do this. <laughs> but that is everything that I got on my haul and I hope you guys like this and if you did please give it a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe and you guys have a good day bye